Here's the difference between speaker view and gallery view in Zoom. I'm going to share four examples and help you avoid two common mistakes. Those are the power tips coming up at the end of the video. Here we are in Zoom with four participants. My desktop computer, my laptop computer, my Android phone, and I also have connected an iPhone with the camera switched off. We are currently in gallery view mode. If I click on the view there, you see that gallery has been checked. In gallery view, you see all your participants and you can also move around the order. So I can just grab my laptop there, for example. I can grab my Android phone there and I can rearrange these in any order that I want. But let's go back to the original where I have the desktop on the top left and then my laptop on the top right. The next view we will have a look at is speaker view in a Zoom window. So I'm going to bring my microphone with me and then I'm going to go down to my laptop and click on view and then select speaker view. And now the active speaker has been highlighted and put almost full screen on my laptop computer. And that active speaker is in fact me right here on the desktop computer. So this is now almost full screen on my laptop because I selected speaker view on the laptop. Zoom uses the audio to decide who is the active speaker. And there is only one audio device in this entire meeting and it is this microphone right here on my desktop computer. In this configuration, we can see the other participants' videos along the top of the screen, but there is another way to show them as well. Let me go back to the laptop. We are now back at the laptop. I'm going to click on the view button up here and then I will select full screen. Now we can see all of the other participants along the right hand side of the image and we can also choose what kind of layout we have. We have this which is kind of a gallery view layout. This is the one we originally had. This one will only show my laptop camera and then the full speaker behind me. And then the last one here this is going to turn off all the other videos except for the one from the active speaker. And as you can see, I can also move it down. So in this configuration, we have me as the desktop participant, as the active speaker, completely full screen on the laptop. For the last configuration, let's go back to my desktop right here. And we are still in gallery view in the zoom window. I'm going to click on view and you can see that we are in gallery. But for this demonstration, I want to go to full screen instead. This looks almost the same, but the window is now full screen and you don't see any of the Zoom window border anymore. In just a moment, I'm going to share my two power tips. If you really want to level up your video conferencing skills, download my free video conferencing checklist. Use the link in the video description or simply go to marcuspresents.com slash checklist. Power tip number one, speaker view will never show you your own video. That's why I had to demonstrate this on the laptop. By selecting speaker view on the laptop, I was able to get the full screen view of the desktop feed. Power tip number two. Your selection of speaker view or gallery view only impacts your own computer. It has no effect on what the meeting looks like to the other participants. But there is one exception, and that's a hybrid meeting where you combine online participants and in-room participants in the same meeting. When you're in the room and you select speaker view or gallery view, you should take into consideration not only yourself, but also the other people who are in the room. For example, when the person speaking has joined via Zoom, then it's a good idea to put the in-room projector or TV in speaker view so that everybody in the room can clearly see the online speaker. Likewise, when the speaker is in the room, it's better to put the Zoom meeting in gallery view so that the person in the room can see as many faces as possible on the projector or on the TV. For more tips on how to run an excellent hybrid meeting, click or tap the screen right here. My name is Marcus Seppala. Thank you for watching.